All right, this is my Ode to Adam Savage's one day build. I'm building a bike trainer table uh, so I can put my computer up on it. And uh, I'm replicating a table from uh, Wahoo Fitness. Here's the look at it here. It's really nice. It's got, it's all aluminum or metal. It's got telescoping legs. The problem is it's, it's well, it's not a problem. It's $250. And uh, what I'm making is going to be far less elegant, but also for about $30 worth of wood, uh, maybe $35 at the most, and, uh, and also maybe a half a day's worth of labor putting it together. So uh, one of the things I wanted to show you is uh, they always say you never have enough clamps, and I guess today I've, I've, I agree with that. I'm using every clamp I've got here. The reason I've got this all clamped up is because there's a whole lot of weight up on top, and uh, I'm trying to keep it from teetering over while I put the last uh, uh, tabletop leg on. Uh, you can see right here that uh, that leg across the top there is making it's the lots of uh, counterweight, so the clamps are weighting it down and all of that. So, uh, so that was it. So it's got uh, a base, two legs up. Uh, all of it's made out of, pl of two by fours, except for the tabletop. Uh, the tabletop is three quarter inch plywood. Here's the end product. You can see it here. Uh, there is a bike here that uh, is on my trainer, so I ride that. The computer's on top. That's kind of the point of the table. Uh, I use the table for uh, playing with Zwift, which is an online uh, virtual bike uh, training app where you can actually ride with friends online, which is pretty cool. You can see I've got my fan there in the middle of summer in, in Southern California. It gets pretty hot in the garage. So you got to have a fan blowing on you. And, uh, you know, there's also plenty of room on the tabletop for my gloves, my water bottles, all that kind of stuff. And uh, you can see the computer there uh, for that. And there's the fan again. So, you know, that's kind of what the basics of the table is here. Uh, real quick here, I'm going to put some holes right across the top so I can run my cable through the bottom. And down here, probably put a shelf that we can use uh, for uh, to put the cables up on top. There's never been water in the garage, but I might. Uh, I want to just get the power supply and stuff off the ground. So uh, the last thing is that I might try to do is I might put it on casters just in case I want to move it around. It does weigh a bunch, so uh, but uh, but that's what it is. So there's my one day bike build. Uh, probably three four hours of time and forty thirty five forty dollars. So easily saving $200 uh, from buying it online. And, uh, and I had a lot of fun doing it, too. So that's all from here. Brian's Adam Savage one-day build wannabe. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed it.